Hello everyone and welcome to your daily tarot reading. I've not done one of these in a while, thought I would do one today. It can resonate for a few days longer than when it releases and it won't be for everyone, so take what resonates for you. So without further ado, I wish you a lovely day and let's get straight into the reading. Sagittarius, let's see what we have for our lovely Sagittarians. Thank you, Angel Spirits Guides. For the day message for our lovely Sagittarians for the day. Oh nice, we have the butterfly transformation. So you're in a process of emerging into a butterfly. You know, I always say moving from a chrysalis to a butterfly is not an easy process. In fact, it's quite a difficult process, but something beautiful comes out at the end of it. This is your transformation. So let's see what we have for you. Message for our lovely Sagittarians. Thank you. Angel Spirits Guides. Message for Sagittarius. Thank you. We have the Three of Cups. Eight of Swords. And we have the Hanged Man. There is a feeling here, Sagittarius, the... The Hanged Man can be when we choose to wait we don't do anything, we hold on decisions, we let things play out. Now, the Three of Cups can be a, a coming together, very positive in terms of reunions, uh, coming together potentially after difficulty as well. So I feel that there is some kind of coming together energy that's requested of you, whether it's to do with a friendship circle, whether it's to do with family, could be love romance as well. Um, but this feels like it, this is about coming together in joy. Feeling of the winter is over, the spring is here. And I'm getting the energy here that this is what's requested of you. Can we come together? Can we put whatever's gone on behind us? With the Eight of Swords, it might well be that you were planning to walk away, but you're deciding not to right now because you're giving somebody the benefit of the doubt. So this is, I'm not going to do anything right now. There is some kind of negative thinking as well that's leading up to this and leading up to this reading. Something's caused you to be in this kind of mental state of, of not sure which way to move forward, not sure which decision to make. So we stay put because we don't want to make the wrong decision. Uh, so, but you, know, you understand that you might be looking at your options. You might be looking at which way to go, but you're not sure which way to go. You're not clear in a decision right now. So you just wait um, because you're hoping that things are going to transform for you. And the card is showing that there is transformation in your current situation. So you're wise to stay put. You're wise to let things play out because when we give people the benefit of the doubt, when we let things take their course and just hold on decisions and not do anything, uh, because really the Eight of Swords isn't in that mental state to make a decision. You might not have the information, the knowledge, or you might want to get more information before you, before you make a significant decision. This is these energies here. So we, we suspend ourselves, we, we, we're open to looking at things in a different way, we're open to see how things play out. And ultimately, we put the onus on the other person or people. And one of two things can happen. Either we're disappointed, get, we're disappointed again by that person or people and we walk away then, that's our answer. Or there is absolutely transformation available to you where you're so pleased that you gave somebody the benefit of the doubt. Either way, the best thing to do today is not to do anything. Hold on a decision. 
If you're not clear in which way to go, then the cards are telling you wait until you are and you will get that answer. And sometimes when we when we wait, when we let things play out, it's the wisest decision of all because we put the responsibility on others to prove that things can change and transform in a very profound way. With the transformational energy here around you, it looks very hopeful, but like I said here, Sagittarius, sometimes when we do nothing is the wisest thing to do. Affirmation for our lovely Sagittarians, thank you for the day. I am strong enough to face every issue in my life with courage and trust. I listen to the intuitive wisdom of my own feelings. I am guided from within, very hanged man energy. This is about being open, being open, seeing how things play out and you get your answer. That's what I have for you. I hope you enjoyed your reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I wish you a wonderful day. I will see you next time.